Welcome to the fish room guys. So I'm doing some water changes, but today I want to show you um, I did a video yesterday. I got some matten filters that'll be going in this 10 gallon rack So it's three wide uh, The room is heated. Everything's run off of air and sponge filters um, I've started adding some of my matten filters, but as you can see everything has either these uh, dull uh, suction cup sponge filters they work pretty well um, they polish the water nice but they also kind of clog up quick um, I'm also using your standard sponge filter here and they work great I've been using them for over two years or so uh, these same exact sponges uh, in the entire fish room the 20 gallons have them and they're gonna stay that way for a while but for the 10 gallon tanks it's a lot harder to get to the back of the tank and get around and catch fish and these kind of clog up sometimes the suction cups fall off It'll kind of float around. So this tank's been running for about a month or so. I bought this one first. Uh, they look really clean. I like the look of them. And once I have these filled up from the water change, I'll show you what it looks like. But I want to show you before I uh, converted everything over. So all these tanks on uh, the 10 gallon rack are gonna be converted. They're gonna get the matten filter. I'm gonna leave the old sponges in there. I might bring them out a little bit because they have all the bacteria in them. They're probably going to just sit there non-connected uh, in front of the matten filter for at least a month or two and then I'll move those in new tanks, keep them cycled or I'll sell those. I'll sell them on my website sometimes if people want to cycle aquarium fast. But you can see I did these uh, left side first three and I'm going to fill these up. I'm going to finish putting them all in and let's take a look what it looks like after I'm done. Alright, so I have all of the tanks with the new Madden filter installed and I finished up my water changes. Uh, I'm definitely just initially liking the new look of this. It gives you like a black bottom and a background uh, with these Madden, Madden filters. Uh, the way it reflects off the bottom of the tank and it, obviously the background is going to be black. Uh, the other thing I did modify on, a few, on one of these tanks is if you have a smaller fish or especially plecos that like to swim against the current, like this tank, I have my uh, super reds and my long fins and calicos in this tank. Uh, they're gonna wanna swim behind uh, and down that PVC. So all I did is I put a little screen over that and I rubber band it on there. Um, you can find that at like a craft store. It's usually for yarn and for sewing. So you can find those in uh, sheets and you can cut off little pieces. Uh, if I wanted to, I could do it on every tank, but for my guppies, it's not really necessary. Or if I have like one pleco in a tank, um, I can easily keep track of that one pleco and I'll find them. Uh, whenever you're growing out a bunch of them in the tank, or if you're trying to breed plecos, it'd be smart to put a screen over that. Besides that one modification, I'm pretty happy with the way this is looking. And it's gonna really help uh, filter my tanks better. And overall, I just really enjoy the look. So let me know what you guys think. Uh, I'm definitely happy I made this uh, change and I switched it up. I'll give it a month or two until I take out the old sponge filters and then I'll add them to other tanks and maybe double them up or I'll sell those online or locally like I said for people that want to cycle and start an aquarium a lot faster. If you want to find these uh, filters yourself, uh, I purchased them from Aquacrilla. I'll put a link in the description for these guys. Uh, they sell a lot of wholesale, but they also will sell to you individually if you call them. Uh, for me, they ship them to me, but in the Pittsburgh area, they'll actually make deliveries and they have a few other locations they'll go to. So you guys can give them a call. I talked to Steve, he was really helpful. If you wanna tell him that uh, Mitch sent you from Pittsburgh Pets, uh, you can do that. I don't know if they'll give me discounts or anything, but you can just let them know that where you found it. I'm sure that's helpful for them. I'm gonna need more time to really test these filters out to give you more updates on how they're working. Um, but I did a lot of research before I made this move and I think they're gonna work out great for me. Um, thanks for watching the video. I will have another video coming out in the next few days. I have some uh, artificial plants. I'm gonna do like a fake planted tank. It's gonna be like a low tech tank in my uh, 55 gallon. So if you're not already subscribed, Go below, like the video, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you know when I post another video. Uh, thanks again for watching, guys, and I'll talk to you soon.